Is Tuesday really the best day to buy airfare? And does the Nexus card really get you through the line faster in the long run? Today, we're playing true or false, breaking down some travel myths with the help of our very own intrepid traveler, Lauren Christie. Welcome to the show again. Um, let's let's run through these because people have hard and fast beliefs as to whether these are true or not. You're going to sure. give us the straight goods, true or false. Booking your flight and hotel as individual components is cheaper than booking a package. That is generally false. Uh, packages tend to be cheaper, and part of the reason is, you know, hotels, for example, they often want a certain amount of rate integrity if they're selling directly to you, right. but often they'll sell them a little bit cheaper to a company that promises to bury the actual cost of the room with other things like breakfast or passes to attractions or a car rental. So most of the time, once you break it out, it's cheaper to go with the package. Now, that also comes with a small caveat. Maybe you don't want all the components of that package, of course, but if everything is in there that you want, generally the package is the better way to go. Okay, I'm glad to be asking this because someone told me that this was true, but you're gonna tell us whether it is or not. Your hotel key card, okay, can be used to steal your identity. Absolutely false. There See, is, there is I, no <laughs> personal data on a hotel key card. I work in the hotel business when I'm not here and I can tell you that is false. Okay, good to know. True or false, booking at the last minute gets you the best deals. Um, that is mostly false. Now there's, sometimes it can be true, but mostly it's false. You know, it's all about supply and demand and you know, airlines, for example, one of the, the common ones is within 21 days, your rates are gonna go way up. So oh, it kind of depends yeah. on what you call last minute, but airlines, yeah, not so much. And hotels, neither. Really, I mean, hotels, the, bu the busier they get, the more the rates are going to go up. Now, there are, again, exceptions, like if there's a large hotel that uh, has a group in it that cancels, maybe you'll get a last-minute good deal, like Pan Am is a good example. There was hotels in downtown Toronto that were holding onto blocks for Pan Am right. that were released about three months out, so all of a sudden there was these great deals over Pan Am games, but don't count on that. Okay, so true or false, the best way to get through customs quickly is to have a Nexus card. I think it is, for sure. A Nexus card, for those who don't know, it's a, it's a bi-national pass for customs and immigration that you, gets you through the U.S. and then when you come back into Canada. But you do have to go through an application, so there is some work yeah. on the outside. Um, but I think it is faster. And one tip that I actually read in On Route magazine, which was good, if you're getting a Nexus card, um, do your interview, which you're going to have to do mm -hmm. if you pass the application, at a land border versus an airport. Because the airport, that's where everyone thinks about it, the waiting list is long and it can take weeks or oh, months, whereas the land border takes a couple days in your process. So try to set up your interview at a land border. True or false, Tuesdays, best, best day to buy airfare. Uh, that is false. It used to be true back in the day. Oh. Um, the reason that that's sort of a myth out there is that back in the day, you know, airfares, airlines it would release all of their, their new fares out to the travel agents on Tuesday night. So if oh. you were on the phone at 12.01, you got the best <laughs> deal. But now in the age of the internet, that has just gone out the window. So it's really um, the, the, what you need to remember. It's not about when you fly or when you buy. It's mm -hmm. about when you fly. Okay. So go for, you know, midday, off-peak business hours, and that's when you're going to get your best deals. Lauren Christie, thank you Thanks. for coming in. For a full list of Lauren's travel myths, head to our website, canadaam.ctvnews.ca.